Uh, honeymoon baby. Uh oh. Uh, stay tuned, you guys. Might have an announcement video. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Kidding, kidding. What's up, what's up? We are on our honeymoon. And. Hi, you guys. <laughs> we, we had a really long drive, so I just wanted to take a little quick cat nap, and he decides he wants to bust the camera out on you when I'm trying to wake up still that's why i look crazy but hi we haven't seen you guys in like three weeks we're so happy to see you and first off before we even go any further we just want to say thank you so much to everybody for all the feedback on our wedding video you guys really liked it a lot and when we saw it we said we just we have to share it with them because we think they're really going to like it and you guys did so thank you so much for watching it and all the thumbs up and all the comments we have read every single one of those comments and we appreciate them so thank you yes. we're married now we married now y'all so it's all right. it's all legal it, everything goes now <laughs> <laughs> oh and show them that, that let's see the ring oh my gosh let's Stop see the ring that. let's see the ring <laughs> don't get don't 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 even start with that every woman out there wants to see the ring too uh, and you know it i know women they just want to see it they don't want you to show off they just oh i'm not showing it. off i just showed it show them your ring uh, it's just it's just a regular silver band yeah because nobody cares about that oh, uh, <laughs> who cares about mine you know as long as i have it on right <laughs> mm. But we are going to be here for four days, three nights. We are at a bed and breakfast um, up in Connecticut, right on the water. Let me take you outside real quick. It is absolutely gorgeous out here. It is absolutely gorgeous. The sun's just dropping. It's about 6.30 right now. And we wind up getting here uh, 2.30. We got up at 6.30, 7 o'clock this morning. After running around for 7 or 8 hours yesterday, mm -hmm. getting everything ready for this, she had no idea where we were going. I told her it was just a it was just a surprise. Just get in the car. We're gonna drive, and where we stopped is where we're gonna be. But uh, we got this is called the suite. It's a nice room. I mean, it's a nice big area. It's a nice big room. It's I don't know. I'll do a little. But it's on the bottom floor. We have our own porch. See. We have our own little porch and then we have little chairs and stuff out there it is really nice it's one of those little those little town yeah. little mayberry towns it is it's like a sweet little quaint seaside town i mean this is like one of those towns you should have maybe we'll show it to you tomorrow if we go past it again the police station the police station is like this little building it's so adorable this is like yeah, really it mayberry like, it was like <laughs> three Three police cars that's it <laughs> that was it i mean we walked the whole town yeah. in like in like uh 30 minutes mm -hmm. i mean literally we stopped and we forgot to we forgot to film it but we had lobster rolls oh so good oh my god we had cold lobster rolls which they put kind of like a like a light mayo i'm not a big mayo person i mean i like potato salad and coleslaw and macaroni salads and you know shrimp salads i love uh, she's not a big cold i mean she's not a big mayonnaise person but i tell you what she tore that up uh -huh. and we got a hot one too which was just um lobster and it was and they, had, they had drawn butter and they had butter that you just literally you know melted butter you pour it over top of it oh my god and it was hot well it was warm yeah, you know I warm. Wish we had that yeah yeah uh, we might go get some more because <laughs> it was that good yeah they, 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 but they were a little expensive i mean they were 14 15 dollars a piece you know and they, they weren't big enough that it really you needed two of them to really fill you up mm -hmm. so 
but we wind up walking up down the town. We didn't go into any shops. Um, we're going to save that for tomorrow, so we have something to do. And we saw some antique shops that we wanted to go into. We saw some candy shops. We saw a lot. Of, they have a lot of restaurants. Oh, my God, they have so many restaurants. Yeah, I mean, all sorts of really neat, like, Thai restaurants and, and sushi and just some really neat stuff. And I'll tell you what, I might. We're going to go. I'm going to see how much a massage is. Maybe we'll go get a massage one of those days. Because I tell you what, my back is absolutely killing me. I have some issues with my back right now. And it's, and it's like, real, real bad. I mean, it's like, it's bad. It's, most times I can barely walk sometimes right now. So, you know, that, this, <laughs> this, uh, what was it? A, uh, the, the, the drive up here was... I drove up here, and I'm telling you that it was the last. Let me put it to you this way: It took us five hours to get here, mm -hmm. and the last four, my back and leg was falling asleep in pain. I because kept, I kept saying, "Do you want me to drive? Do you want me to drive?" And he said, "No." So hey, I, I tried. That's because I was scared to get out of the car because of all the pain I knew I was going to be in. You know, just to straighten myself out, just to get into the other seat, to sit here and be uncomfortable. <laughs> for another three hours it was just it was best to just suck it up deal with it and then when I got here then straighten myself up but it is it is really nice it, it's just one of those it's gonna be a nice just relaxing which is exactly what we need because you guys anyone who's been married or thrown a wedding knows that the last two or three weeks leading up to it is pure chaos and that's what that was I mean the last two or three weeks leading up to the wedding my mom was in town we were running here there and everywhere and by the time the wedding came we were just flat out exhausted we couldn't wait for that wedding to be over not only because we would be married at the end of it but because we wouldn't have a, have to plan a wedding anymore we were so sick of it so over it so tired and I'm so glad that we're here because we can just be still. We can just be still and enjoy being newlyweds. Sorry guys, the camera cut off for some reason. But what I was saying was, um, we're here because we were just so tired of all of us running around and the wedding nonsense. I mean, going here, there, everywhere, meetings and fittings and we've got to go to the rehearsal dinner and we've got to pick people up at the airport and we've got to this and we've got to that. By the time the wedding finally came, we were so happy, not only because we would be married, but because the wedding stuff, planning stuff, would be over. And it's over now, and we're married, and we get to just mm -hmm. be still and enjoy each other, be newlyweds, and just be married. Which is what we wanted in the first place, to just be married. And now we are. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. So we are going to enjoy the next couple of days. We're going to take you along with us. Um... If it seems to be a big video, we're we're not sure if we're going to do a long video or we'll just do like two parts so that way we're not boring the heck out of you. <laughs> so, we are, we're going to, what? Oh, I don't know. I was just going to uh, say, I don't know. I don't know if we'll see you guys later tonight or if we'll, I don't know if we'll see you guys later tonight or if we'll see you tomorrow, but we will see you. Oh, you ain't going to see it tonight. <laughs> They've already seen me at my worst because you want to bust out the camera while I look like who did it and why. Oh, you ain't going to see it for the rest of the night. Oh, my goodness. That's right. We're married now, so it's all okay. That's right. <laughs> all right. Remember she said that. <laughs> yes, indeedy. All right. We will see you either in the morning. Yeah, we'll probably see you in the morning sometime. Okay.
Yeah, it's really nice. We've been kind of laying low today because I wasn't really feeling that well. Thank you. Enjoy. Can I get a shot of that? Yeah, we've been kind of laying low today because I wasn't feeling that well. You remember he wasn't feeling that well yesterday. Today's my turn. So <laughs> we've been laying low today. We went, um, did a little bit of antiquing. We went to the candy shop, the little local candy shop, and we got some candy, which we don't need, but YOLO. Um, yeah, we've just been hanging out today. Now we're about to stuff our faces. Uh, yes. I'm going to show you everything we get in a minute, and uh, we'll be doing a lot more tomorrow. So going to be a lot more stuff going on tomorrow. So. We'll, we'll show you when we get this stuff out. Mm -hmm. Dun, dun, dun. I didn't even eat anything. I we had a little bit of sushi. I had I think two or three pieces. So by the time my food came, I was just done. But you know what it really was? Before we got here, I ate a little bit of junk food and I showed it. Let me tell you something. She ate a whole bag of chips. A whole bag. We already had this discussion about the chip thing. <laughs> and she ate some candy from the candy shop that we went to. So she's munching and munching and munching. When we get here, she has like two or three pieces of sushi and that was it. That is been it. So, I'm, I'm not eating everything. That's what I have left. So, but before I came here, I ate a whole sub and uh, <laughs> a whole cheesesteak sub and uh, what else? You were snacking with me. And I snacked a little bit, but I ate the whole sub and then I came here and ate, ate about two rolls of sushi mm -hmm. and the other stuff. So yeah, he had enough room for all of that because he has a bottomless pit for his stomach. He can eat and eat and eat and he just keeps shoveling it in. And you know what he even does sometimes? Even if he's full, he'll still keep putting more food in his stomach. It's like, I think he feels guilty if he doesn't eat it all. I don't know, but he'll just keep going. I'll say, why don't you just stop? Okay. Oh, but I'll just, I'll just have a little more. And he'll be huffing and puffing like trying to get it done. I'm like, just stop it. You're full. It's okay. to leave the rest of it. I can't, I can't. It's wasting food is not... <laughs> I can't waste food. I can't. I can't waste food. I will shovel it in until I feel like I'm going to throw up. And then I'll drink a little coffee or water, take a breather, and then I'll come back and eat some more. So, yeah. Alright, so maybe we'll see you guys later on tonight, but if not, we will definitely see you tomorrow. Yes. Yeah. Got a busy day tomorrow. And we're getting tired. So, good night, Michael. Good night, Michael. Where are we going today, baby? I'm not sure. Are we going to the huge, ginormous mall or are we going to the seaport? We might do both. Alright. We're going to go to an antique mall. <coughs> I guess it's a mall. It's 12,000 square feet. So, I don't know. We'll see. Watch. Keep going. Keep going. Dance moves. All right, all right. Here we are. We're doing a little antiquing. Yes. So. One of our favorite pastimes. Yes. We only just got married less than two weeks ago. And we're already an old married couple. <laughs> <laughs> we're walking around antiquing like we're in our 70s. <laughs> yeah. well, I've already got a couple things. I got a couple little knives and stuff. I collect knives. So, you know, old ones, new ones. Uh, all sorts of stuff, so like that, and cufflinks, and a couple other little things. So we're here just looking around, trying to get some stuff done. It's raining outside. We were going to head down to the port today, but yeah, we'll have to see about that. Yeah, we'll have to see about that. So after this, we're going to try to go somewhere else that's indoors now and uh, try to get some stuff done. But we've been kind of hitting this with recording because we've been we've been honeymooning yes i was gonna say we've been in bed most of the time <laughs> so you didn't have to say that uh, yeah. <laughs> but 
But you know, we're just we're just relaxing, having some fun. Because when we get back, back you know, to real life. Back to work. Back to real life. Back to getting her pregnant. You know. uh, honeymoon baby. Uh oh. Uh, stay tuned, you guys. Might have an announcement video. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Kidding, kidding. <laughs> <laughs> She's watching our video. You guys have a launch date. Watch it. It's really good. It is. It's a good video. Watch it. This is where you are staying right here. If you see the little area on your left hand side, this little area right there, and that's where we're staying. It's our own little suite. Uh, it's like kind of like the honeymoon suite. But it is overlooking all the boats, the harbor, everything all the way down. It is absolutely gorgeous here. It's a small little quaint town. I mean, it is. It's one of those. Everybody, everybody in town knows who you are. It definitely is nice. It is absolutely gorgeous. This is some place that we've talked about coming. We'll probably come again. Not like every year because I just drove five and a half hours, six hours to get up here, and I, mm, I'm not a good driver, as in I don't like to drive for a long period of time. So, plus my back's been killing me. So that's never a good thing. But we are about to go to the bay. Hopefully, it's been raining on and off. It's about to start to. It's going to start clearing up soon. So we're going to head to the bay and see what they have down there. And that's why they call it the Grey Goose. Because there he is. And it was raining today, so there was only so much we could do, but it cleared up. So we decided to come down here to um, Mystic. Mystic, Connecticut. It's a little village, and it's really, really cool. There's so many historic houses around here. I mean, like, really historic. Really, really historic. I mean, yeah. they said that this, we went past the sign, Welcome to Historic Mystic, and it said it was settled in 1650 something or other. Now, that's yeah. that's talk about Americana for you. Yeah. <laughs> that's Americana. Yep. All right, everybody, we are back. Yes, and this is the end of the vlog. We forgot to end it. We came back home from our mini honeymoon and we just forgot to end it. Mm -hmm. And we're sorry, this was kind of like a lazy vlog. We know it was a little bit of a lazy vlog. We didn't do too much. We didn't show too much. But, you know, we were honeymooning. You guys understand, right? So, that's the end of this one. <laughs> I don't know what he just did. I'll see it in the editing, but something crazy. I'm sure no, he had. <laughs> but as always, thank you so much for watching. Oh, this is a kiss from my husband, y'all. Thanks so much for watching, and we will see you next time. All right. Bye. See you next week. Bye.